In this section, we're going to talk about data sampling and pie charts. There are two types of data, categorical or qualitative data, and quantitative or numerical data. For categorical data, think of categories or qualities. A variable that places individuals into a group or category is called a categorical or qualitative variable. In other words, this is data that consists of names or labels. For example, eye color, we can label eye colors as being brown, being green, being black, etc. We got ethnic groups, blood types, relationship status, we can label relationship status as single, married, in a relationship, etc., etc. The city a person lives in, these are all examples of categorical variables. On the other hand, quantitative or numerical data, think of quantity or numbers. Variables that measure a quantity are quantitative variables. In other words, data that is measured in numbers and always has some kind of units. A really good way to distinguish if a variable is quantitative or categorical is to determine if it has units. For example, height has units. In the United States, we measure height in inches. Salary has units, we measure salary in dollars. Weight has units, we measure weight in pounds. Age has units, we measure age in years. Eye color, ethnic group, blood type, relationship status, the city a person lives in, neither of these have units. Therefore, they're categorical. Anything that has units, it's quantitative. Another way to think about whether a variable is quantitative or categorical is think about whether or not we can place a variable in some kind of order. For example, for height, we can uh, put a group of people in order from shortest to tallest. In age, we can put a, a group of people in order from youngest to oldest. Can we put people in order according to eye color? No, because one eye color isn't better or worse than another. Can we put people uh, in order based on relationship status? Absolutely not. We can put them in different categories. You are single, you are married, you are in a relationship, but we can't order them in some kind of systematic way. Okay, so two ways to think about whether a variable is quantitative or categorical. If you can order the variable in some way, and if it has units, it's, it's quantitative or numerical. If you can place it in categories without having any kind of units or order, then it is categorical or qualitative. I want you to decide whether each of these would result in a categorical or quantitative variable. And we will go over this in class.